So if you don't have like a two by four or an angled um, slant board, you can use two dumbbells anywhere from five to 10 pounds, should be plenty high enough after that, might just get a little too high. But take these, put them on the ground, and you can elevate your heels by using that. If, if you have ankle mobility issues and things like that, this will make getting down into your squat much smoother, much easier when you do that, okay? Because you're eliminating that uh, inability to actually dorsiflex stiff the ankle. So if you have stiff ankles, stiff calves, um, reaching through there, and you want to get into deeper squat pattern to get more quad and glute work out of that, you can just elevate the heels again. So you just throw your heels on there. So I'll show a side view, right? This can be done with several different exercises. But just by throwing them on there, and again, you can go with a narrow or a wider stance. If you wanted to make it more like a cyclist squat, you can bring the feet in a little bit closer and flare the toes out a little bit as well, okay? So there, you notice how as I drop down, it makes that squat pattern much easier if you have that ankle issue, right? So if I step off, you can see how it's much harder for me to get down into that squat because I have stiff ankles as well as a runner. So up there, you see how much more upright I can keep that torso as I squat down. Anyway, just another little hack that you guys can do if you have stiff ankles and still want to get into deeper squats.